Hello Collective, welcome to Collectively Chosen, this is Kelly coming to you with your collective message. Thank you guys and gals so much for your love support, okay, and um, your bookings and things of that nature. I see some of you have booked from, um, you all have booked from this channel as well, so I appreciate that. So let's get into your reading, because I'm seeing here... Somebody's upset because somebody wants to come towards you, okay? This is somebody, you're, you and this person have not come together yet. I feel like there's some sort of um, transition or something that's taking place. Or someone or something has to be cut out beforehand, all right? Um, somebody here, though, you do have another feminine that is jealous of the fact that someone, I feel like, wants to come towards you. Is the energy that I'm getting. And somebody is losing patience with the situation. Okay. Um, this person could be like, stop me if you think you can. Um, somebody thinks you're very cute. Somebody thinks that you're attractive. Okay. Um, they feel like that, you know, you could be about your business. You could be a bit serious. But at the same time, you still had this, this jovial uh, side to you as well. Okay. Let's see. What is this? All right. So we have okay rather be cautious than sorry all right so some of you all may be making plans when it comes to you know the way that you work on things do things <coughs> excuse me somebody is being very strategic at how they want to come towards you is what i'm feeling here um i do feel like that you are not overthinking a situation okay uh you know right now something could be blocked because you know, you may feel as though it may not be under the right circumstances at this time. Give me death and your person in the reverse. You at the airport with the what a coincidence. So whoever this is, um, mm, Okay, somebody feels like you could definitely be like a match for them in some way. Okay, uh, let's see what's going on here, collective. Okay, somebody feel like you feel cozy. Oh, okay. <laughs> that they could be cozy and comfortable in your skin. And this person feels like you're comfortable and cozy in your own skin. Like, this is someone they know. Like, you know how to set boundaries. Like I say, at the end of the day, <clears throat> they feel like... You know, you are someone who, you could be loving and caring, but at the same time, you know what I mean? Like, you are, you're, no, you, you, you're about your business, you're no nonsense, and you're straight to the point. You know what I mean? They feel like you're truthful, you're a straight shooter. Give me more on, stop me if you can. Mm. Somebody's losing their patience for the situation, though. Okay. Ooh, we said, somebody said, no way. Uh, okay. I'm going to get you this time. Okay, so somebody here wants to be playful with you, uh, collective. All right. Um, somebody want to see what you are like outdoors, like outside of your comfort zone. I feel like whoever this is, this is someone who's very stable. Okay, they have a lot going for themselves. Somebody here could be trying to figure out why they feel so tired and sluggish. All right, somebody's feeling bored and disinterested. So, <clears throat> excuse me, if this person is good, yeah. Somebody could be connected to somebody else here. Um, this could also be um, like the type of energy of, you know, you and this person could be kind of like feeling the same energy. See, look, hey, cutie. Well, somebody is jealous. Somebody could be eyeing you. Somebody could feel like that they have to pacify someone and they're getting tired of having to pacify whoever this person is. Give me something with swimming with the sharks. All right. Swimming with the sharks. Okay, I'm so grateful for my abundance. Then we have Boo. I feel cozy. So some of y'all could be staying to yourself at this time, okay? 
taking selfies. <laughs> all right, showing yourself some love. All right, but I feel like somebody is going to possibly too startle you. So be mindful of that. All right, somebody could be playing, like they could startle you, like talking to you. They could be sitting in their car, but somebody here is making some sort of plans. It may take them some time, but they're working on it. I am devoted to evolving into my highest expression. Okay, so I like that. Whoever this is, they're planning on working on themselves. Mm. Right now, this person could be feeling kind of void. Okay, no, no. Thanks. You don't have to. Okay, so someone feels as though you make them feel appreciated. You make someone very, very happy. Okay, whoever, the, like I say, whoever this person is, like you give this person some sort of energy or something here. <laughs> Wait a minute, collective. Okay, um, a lot of you could be definitely in this energy of gratitude. Give me more about this five of swords. Uh, whatever reverse okay so you may not be met like whoever this person that may be upset with you or mad at the fact um that this person is eyeing you or looking at you or crushing on you like you're not paying any paying this person any mind like this is somebody you've already possibly set the tone with before at some point Okay, I feel like a lot of you, you are in your divine energy. Give me more on the Ace of Swords and the Celebratory Man in the reverse. You have to pay for your betrayal. So somebody here, this person is going to want them, want someone to pay for some sort of betrayal here. Okay, truth is, someone think they won in a situation, but they didn't. Okay, um... Thank God you're safe. So somebody could have been a little shocked trying to... Somebody could be shocked here, like in a sense of... Somebody's trying to salvage something. And I feel like this masculine is like, they don't want any parts of it. We are two people who grow together, heal together, and touch our toes together. So it's this energy of, I just feel like somebody really feels like they could grow with you. They could, they could see themselves with you, okay? Um, this is someone you may want to, like you may just be the natural type that would want to help out or want to you know assist your you know somebody that you care about or you know like you like the uh what, what how am i trying to say you you like to take on your brunt of the work right um you know do your fair share you don't feel like that you like to put all the burden on you know one particular person in your connection so but this person may be the type of person be like, you know, they're touched and moved that you want to, you know, help them out or, you know, of, of some of some sort of situation. It's something, okay, that you may try to help this person with. And they're like, no, 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 you don't have to. Thank you. You know, or you could be that way. You know what I'm saying? This person may try to help you in some way, shape, or form. And you could be like, oh, no, I got it. Like, you know, even if they say, oh, you need help, 909. Um, zero nine zero nine. You know, you need help with your groceries, and you're like, oh no, no, thank you, I have it. Okay. Um, hmm. Yeah. For some of you, there is a person though that you could be talking to that you feel as though someone here is not worth it, but somebody here I feel like is losing their patience with a situation or you could have lost your patience with it all right i'm going to get you this time so again like i say somebody wants to be very playful with you okay snow could be significant um i know i am safe and protected by my loving universe so
Somebody could be real, uh, yeah, somebody here is really abundant. This is someone who they do, they definitely show gratitude. I feel like this person too likes the fact that you take time out for yourself. When they see you, you're always in a happy mood, okay? A happy, jovial mood. And this person is feeling like whatever it is that they're working on letting go, okay? Um, they feel like it's for the best, okay? Um... This is someone that they're very, they're non-judgmental, okay? They don't look at people in any certain way. You know, they allow people to live their own lives. But whoever this other person that they are around, this person could be kind of cranky, okay? Um... Somebody could be acting like everything is okay, but it's really not, okay? They could feel like maybe they have to pacify someone, you know, um, just to keep the peace in a situation. Two swords. So somebody's trying to block out like something, everything is everything. Um, somebody's intuition could be blocked as well. And they may need to take a cleansing bath, take time off for yourself, okay? All right, somebody could be doing something that they know better in doing. All right, is this right for me? So somebody could be trying to figure out if something is right for them, okay? Um... I don't know if it's somebody here, it could be a reader trying to figure out if something is right for them. If they still want to pursue something. All right, because somebody could be trying to tell somebody that they're doing something all wrong. I mean, when you're channeling, everybody reads different. Okay, so there is no, I mean, unless you're just completely off the mark and you're not, you know, pretty much reading what's in front of you, depending on what, you know, what's going on. But either way, like, everybody's messages are not going to always be the same. Sometimes we do get similar downloads, okay? But we, for the most part, everybody's messages are not going to be the same. Or, you know, they're not going to be channeled the same. Let me say that. They're not going to be channeled the same. Okay, so I do see this up and down energy here. But I feel like for some of you, you're getting ready to be reborn. There's some sort of balancing that's getting ready to happen. Yes, look, you are intoxicating. Somebody finds you so damn sexy, chair. So damn sexy. Man or woman. Okay, take it how you want. <laughs> now, only thing I would say, um, this person, I do see possibly a trend of, you know... This person may drink, okay? So, you may want to watch that as well. But somebody definitely um, has their eyes on set on you, okay? But there's a third party here that's pissed off about it. Never realized how beautiful sun looks from the sea. So, some of you, I don't know. Um, I think I mentioned that in one of the... Gemini readings about somebody possibly taking some sort of a, a cruise or something of that nature, okay? Alright, somebody may feel some type of way. Somebody could be feeling like, I don't know, they could feel like you judge them or uh, you could be feeling like somebody judges you as well. So I do feel like there's different energies here, okay? We have the King of Cups and then we have the Queen of Wands. What did I say? Baby, Spirit is telling you right here, trust the message, all right? Somebody here wants to take a leap of faith with the full car being here. Somebody wants to take a leap of faith with you.
what else can you tell us about this person okay there's a cycle of some sort that they're closing out that they could be stuck in right now thank you confirmation um that they could be stuck in right now but this person does want to reach out to you okay they do plan on taking some sort of action but it's going to be small reason being they can't do too much right now okay they really can't they can't do too much yet eight of swords but they're really in this they could come off like a page of wands but they're really in this king of wands energy okay mm -hmm. so somebody is highly attracted to you yes king of cups they're in their head because what they would like to do and this person is a part of your soul tribe y'all kind of share the same value system i did see the hierophant okay when i first uh shuffled the deck so this person they want to relate to you yes look at this they want to relate to you how they feel they're manifesting this okay they know it's going to take some time so they possibly have to sit on it a little bit now like i say i do see that somebody here could definitely yeah spirit guides so somebody's spirit guides are bringing you two together some of you you may bump at this bump into this person at an event okay all right somebody sees you as a star we got the king of swords king of wands you done had every king come out here collective okay and we only had this queen of swords <laughs> <laughs> this queen of swords out here yes eight of swords in the reverse so you are starting you're going to start feeling yourself and the reason i like this is because okay yeah the reason that i like this is because somebody is going to definitely um want to come out of some sort of energy stagnation with you somebody may even want to gift you something okay uh let's see why is the seven of wands here six of cups okay so you're definitely standing your ground against the past some of you this could have been a past fire sign that you were involved with thank you um a past fire sign that you were involved with so i do feel like you are definitely setting some sort of boundary with past energy okay there could be someone from your past yes look trust the message there could be someone from your past who wants to come towards you communicate with you okay or this is just going to be someone yeah that you feel like um that you feel like y'all are kindred spirits in some way shape or form but i'm really getting to this is more so about past people you know past, the past was making you very small offers and i feel like that's something that yeah they thought that you would be content with and i just don't see that yes first they trust the message okay 1818 18, you could be seeing that angel number exactly sticking to your beliefs i love it something could turn out to be wish fulfillment again it may mm, okay trust the message three of swords now i am seeing this too somebody may come to war this may not be for everybody all right so just be be mindful of what you invest in your time, energy, and effort into as well. Let's see what this is about. What is the Page of Pentacles? So, see, that's what I'm saying. Somebody here feels like somebody here is not a winner. Somebody is having doubts. Why? Give me the hair fat, nine of cups. Gifts of love. Didn't I say somebody's going to want to gift you something? All right. You're going to receive some sort of a gift here. Love me, love me not. Somebody wants to know how you feel about them. Somebody feels like they're confused. Okay. But look, you make somebody feel like a kid again. <laughs> you do. Somebody, okay this person um you're like i'm listening they may ask you you know could i talk to you 
I need you to hear me out. But this could be someone new. That Ace of Cups. King of Cups, Ace of Cups. Because somebody feels like their time is running out on the situation. And they're ready to make some sort of change. They could be feeling like enough is enough. So whatever this past situation is. Or whoever this is that may be upset. That this person is trying to get away from them. Okay. Um, somebody feels like they're ready to make a change. Or somebody's ready to take some sort of a risk. But I do feel like something needs to be done in the right way. All right, with this healing coming out in the reverse, somebody here needs to definitely um, heal a situation, okay? Um, somebody may make a very bold move here, all right? Just make sure that somebody is not trying to love bomb you, all right? Staying up at night, somebody is overwhelmed, they're not sleeping too well, so you have new love and then you have somebody here from the past as well. Give me something on this King of Pentacles. King of Pentacles. Yes, making a choice. A fork in a road. This King of Pentacles, no, there's a there's they're gonna have to make some sort of decision here. Okay. Mm. There's a King of Pentacles. Spirit is telling you to be cautious. Because somebody could be reckless in the way that they do things. Give me something on this Queen of Swords. Not holding anything back. Hidden treasure. Somebody feels like you're a blessing in disguise. That something's going to... Yeah, you're the graduate. See? Mm. Just make sure, collective, you learn whatever karmic lesson. Make sure you've learned it. But I do feel like you have. Okay? Lessons learned. You've done enough. You completed the hard work. All right? So, you could just be making friends with whoever it is. Keeping it casual. You know what I'm saying? Like, okay... But, oh, okay. Somebody wants to kiss any wounds, anything you've been through. Somebody wants to kiss the pain away. Be careful of somebody trying to come in, okay, and be friends with you again. Because this is someone who has, like, a love-hate dynamic, okay? Somebody here could be very two-faced. Beware, protect yourself. Some, okay. It's a bright new day. Somebody does not want somebody to have a new beginning, okay? Um, there's some sort of trouble lurking, and I feel like it's whoever this person is attached to that they're trying to get away from, okay? Uh, yeah, yeah, let's, let's, let's see right quick. What is this? What is this trouble lurking? 2330, as I said that. So you can look up angry number uh, 223. 2233 as well. Okay, spirit guys. Your spirit guys is trying to give you a warning here. The Empress is cross, Queen of Pentacles. Okay, this Emperor is upright. Give me the Empress. Why is the Empress cross? So again, this could okay. So somebody could have children with these people. Ooh, there was some sort of betrayal. There's a tower falling with this situation. What is this ten of swords? This this empress is crossed. This empress has betrayed this emperor. This person is watching to see if somebody. Uh, this emperor. I mean, this empress is watching this emperor to see if they had some. Mm, what is the page of swords? Ten of Cups. This is someone they have a family with. Five of Cups. 
this person is going to be in deep regret. I feel like if something goes wrong here. Could be more on the page of swords. Okay, so this empress either was juggling or she thinks that this emperor is juggling. They could possibly live together, okay? Confirmation. That uh, horn. All right, they could possibly, I don't know, have a car together. The high priestess. Judgment. And the Queen of Pentacles. Three of Cups. Somebody feels like someone here is a match. What is... Okay, so somebody could be... Somebody wants to block someone off here. Or block someone from a new beginning. Someone knows that they're going to have to walk away or block whatever this is. If they want to come towards you. Then I say something to me has to be done by the book Ten of Pentacles. Okay, so this person, granted, I feel like they're, whoever this is, they could have been with this person at least 10 years or more, I'm saying. Okay, let me see here. At least 10 years or more. This is someone I feel like they tried to go go the distance, go to the finish line, but they're finding themselves like repeating cycles here. Okay. Mm. I'm seeing that too with this. Like, don't be a fool. Walk away from something. Yeah, we have the yen. Walk away from something if you know it's not for you. Where, where, where did it go? Okay, time for nap. Truth be told, boys, what I tell you, somebody likes the way you carry yourself. Something here is definitely faded. Somebody is going to message you. Okay. I feel like you're going to definitely have to clear your head before you make some sort of decision. Somebody feels like you would bring them peace. You would bring them peace. Somebody may end up asking, like, why? Like, why, why me or this person may, the other person may be like, like, why them? Why him? Why her? And this is someone, yeah, because this person feels like they could build something. Whoever this, okay, so whoever they may be with, and then somebody just has a deep knowing. Okay, thank you. Somebody here just definitely has a deep knowing that they want to come towards you, but they know they have to chop wood. They have to get rid of something here before something can move, and, like, they would really have to move on. All right, somebody could be taking some sort of time. Yeah, to be fair, it has it has to balance. It has to be fair. Like there would have to be like a clean slate for this new beginning to take place. Yeah. Hmm. Mm. Whoever this, uh, whoever this person is, they have a family with that they're attached to, okay. Um, with the regeneration, and then I had saw co-create. This person could definitely, yeah, they're trying to think. Mm -mm. Didn't I say by the book? I knew it. Something had to be done by the book. But this, whoever they're, yeah, for this new life, um, whoever they're attached to, this person wants them. Like, they're trying to figure out a way how they can change 
change the situation because they somebody felt like something was going to go to different go to distance but somebody here is feeling like they know they're about to get left out in the cold we have unfinished symphony okay chaos and conflict so a change in the wind and we have chaos and conflict this person whoever this is is a drama person they're going to want to try to mend it. They're going to want to try, yeah. They're going to want to try to clean their act up, okay? Because whoever this is that they're attached to, they are the, they are this person's leg up. And this person, to truly be honest, they don't want this person walking away. <laughs> Look, and we have the Ten of Pentacles here. But this person is like a king of cups. That king of cups we were talking about. And then look, you showing up here too as the queen of cups. Yeah, the hangman. What is this chaos and conflict? Chaos and conflict. Three of Cups reverse. Okay. So that's what I'm saying. Make sure that this don't turn into like no third party BS. And we did see fake friends and stuff like that. Alright, so be mindful of I guess keep it to you. Keep mind, keep your business, your business. Okay. Yeah. Whoever this person is that they live with, this person may want to start some sort of argument or may accuse you of being, yeah, somebody's ego going to be hurt. Um, This person's, this whoever they're dealing with, this person, their ego is hurt or going to be hurt. They don't like the fact that you, how you look either. Okay, the magician here. Hmm. I don't see where anything sneaky is going on. But this person is starting to feel like the cold shoulder. That's the energy that I'm getting. Like somebody feels the cold shoulder. Or could be feeling like somebody here is out messing around or something. Yeah, it would kill this person, honey, if they was to get, if they was to feel like, yeah, oh, somebody's jealous of, you could be, you know, single, independent, you look good, you take care of yourself, and this person, they know, have your own car, like, you have quite a bit going for yourself, okay, um, definitely live on your own. You could be holding back because you know of, 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 of about this situation. Why is the strength in the reverse? Hold on right quick, guys and gals. sudden like this person feels like something is revealed or being revealed what is this give me the sign knight of cups in the reverse so somebody feels like okay feels like like all they do is fuss and fight it's confusion they so okay, okay didn't i tell you you was this queen of cups with the seven of cups right here three of wands they feel like this person is making some sort of plan they know that this person is attractive wow they know that this person is attractive to you now i'm not gonna lie at some point in time they could have been acting like they wasn't happy with this person 
all of a sudden they're going to I ain't gonna lie, some of you, this person may try to accuse them of sleeping with you. Okay. There could also be like a Libra and a Virgo that's having some sort of uh, dealing with a lot of burdens here. And they could be feeling like you're winning right now. All right, they could be heartbroken, yeah. Because they feel like you could have possibly, uh, ooh. Ooh, somebody's dealing with a karmic energy here. Five of Cups, Soul Tribe, Wheel of Fortune, The Devil, Knight of Wands. King of Swords. Okay, so there could also be a King of Swords that's feeling like they're feeling left out in the cold. It's because of their behaviors. Alright, they feel like you could have rejected them in a connection. Okay, they could have had some sharp words for you. Well, them and this person argue a lot. I'm seeing that too. Them and this person could argue a lot. <clears throat> All right, let's see. Um, anything else you want to tell? Anything else the collector needs to know? Anything else the collector needs to know? Okay, so it's not something that's not for you. All right, it's just not right now. Something has to be done by the book. Yes, for some of you, this could be a soulmate, or this person could be thinking this is a soulmate, that you could be a soulmate. This person watches you. could actually be a bit protective over you. What else can you tell us about this person? Come to the edge. Somebody's going to... Okay. So somebody is imagining what would happen if they take this chance. If they take this chance. Once they clean something up here. It's going to leave somebody out in the hole, and I just feel like whoever this person is. No place like home, exchanging gifts. This is somebody who feels like there would be like equal give and take in a situation if they were to be with you. They feel like it's time to go. This person is watching, and they feel like it's time for them to make a decision on which way they're going. But they know they're going to try to do things in a way to be fair, though. This person don't want to do things in a way that's going to cause conflict and chaos because they want you and them in this energy of milk and honey, okay? Um, but they know the, t the clock is ticking if they want to be happy. But there's something that's unfinished here that they have to deal with. And Spirit is saying if they want this new life, okay? Thank you, confirmation. If they want this new life, all right, they're going to have to do something right, okay? They're going to have to do it fair, all right? This person may end up gifting this person something so they can go. They want someone that's a loyal heart. This person sees you as a loyal heart, and they think you're highly attractive. You, you know, you're very abundant on your own, okay? All that glitters ain't gold, all right? Now, we have go the distance, and to be fair, give me something on um, all that glitters. Give me something on all that glitters. Hold on, y'all.
medical fevers. Knight of Cups in the reverse. Okay, three of Cups in the reverse. Four of Swords. Hold back until something has completely come down. Otherwise, you'll regret it. Don't involve yourself. Okay, yeah. Don't involve yourself if the situation is still karmic. Okay, because it is going to start a whole bunch of mess. But this person, they do. They fantasize about you. They feel like y'all make a perfect pair. Ace of Pentacles. Five of Cups. Yeah, don't allow something to become karmic. Stand in your beliefs and you'll see this situation win. You'll win in this situation. But just do things by the book. Don't act out of ego. Thank you. And put yourself in some sort of third party thing. And think her leg up between worlds. Here and now. Yeah, I just feel like somebody is stuck in between worlds right now. And I don't know. This could be you. This could be your person. But I feel like this is... I mean, it's not your person. That's why not you. That's why your person came up in the reverse. It's not your person. I feel like this person could definitely uh, be coming out, getting ready to come out of something. Or trying to get away from someone. That's the energy that I'm getting with this. Okay. Let's see. We're gonna get some um get some oracle here. See what it's talking about. Allow your spirit guides to guide you with this situation. I feel like, you know, just keep living your life. You know, like I say, I just see that, you know, you all, you're cool with just saying hello, goodbye, you know, maybe like a little small talk, but, you know, I don't feel like you're going to allow the situation to go any further than that. some sort of organization going on here. But keep those boundaries up, okay? Is the energy that I'm getting. Keep those boundaries up. You will know when it's time. Allow yourself to be led. This person is going through a transformation right now. There's some sort of dark night of the soul. They are figuring their stuff out. 
they're starting to see a situation for what it is is the energy that i'm getting okay because they're in a situation they're no longer happy in and that's the truth Ruth. that's the truth Ruth. Let me please have some oracle for the collective, please. Okay. Gut feeling. Okay. Oh, wow. Sexual healing, the pleading man. Fun times. Yeah, see, love triangle. Just make sure. This, some of you, this could be a young male, okay? Youthful. Could be dark skinned. Person could have children. This person is in some sort of love triangle. That could be that uh, Knight of Cups in the reverse. That's what they want. They want fun times. You have kings coming at you, baby. Tell them you ain't got time for no damn nights, okay? Nights and pages. Thank you. <laughs> That's why I say keep them damn boundaries up. Look, gut feeling, dating. Look at this. Wallflower lies, you tell career. Think drinks off uh drinks off pain so then i say somebody here could be a drinker mind invasion somebody is thinking about you hard hard I don't know you could be younger than this person this dark uh, male they just want fun times that's too many young male past love ice king karma jack of all trades so there's a past person who could be getting some sort of karma here or doing some sort of spell work this person wants an open relationship with you so you do have past people that are wanting to come back okay but you definitely give me sexual healing mind invasion Wow, somebody want a union. They guilty as charged, bitch. <laughs> right? Ooh, ooh. Somebody wants a serious relationship. Somebody could want to try to tie somebody here. Yeah. Wow, I just said somebody could want to tie somebody here. Look at this soul tie. Guilty as charged. They like, yeah, baby, I want it. Mm-mm. Gut feeling dating. Gut feeling dating. Okay, so some of you, for somebody here, you could think that this person, they're a jack of all trades. They're a ladies' man. They like to have multiple people in their face. Okay. We also have children. So this person could have at least three children. All right. something on union sexual healing mind invasion okay some sort of gossip and then soul tie guilty as charged the boom oh shit heart attack mature man 
Destiny, Beauty Queen, Dating Queen. Somebody wants to know are you dating home? They watch your home to see if you have anybody that uh, possibly comes to you. There could be some sort of gossip. Okay, time out. Who do you love? What did I tell you? Okay, so somebody could be getting ready to go on some sort of break. All right, somebody could be like, you're free to go. Because somebody feels very magnetic towards you. Thank you. I don't look, y'all. I ain't making this shit up. Butterfly, butterfly fat. What is this Ice King special recipe? Soulmate Wallflower. Work, yeah. So we have new love. Somebody wants some sort of revenge. So this per thank you this person is going to say something to get some sort of reaction out of you this person could be really pissed off that you walked away so somebody's going to try to throw shit in the game somebody don't want to see you it's something about you being abundant and having your own money they don't want you out here dating they trying to control your destiny okay somebody Somebody could have gave somebody a heart attack here. Some sort of gossip. Somebody's looking at old photos or something here. Somebody could be trying to say that somebody did some spell work. Cold as ice, short term obstacles. Somebody here is doing some sort of healing. Somebody could have been in some sort of open relationship or there's somebody who is at a distance that want an open relationship with you. Okay, there's three witches who could be possibly getting trauma as well. Okay. Uh, and a fair male that you possibly then took a time out from. So you may don't speak to these people. All right, then we have gifts. Yeah, this person, they sit and they watch your pictures. So, um, I'll be careful because this person could be doing like, like saying things over your photos. So, be mindful of that. Yeah, mature woman. The boom. Something like blowing up like beauty queen. So, somebody feels like you're their true love. You're a true gem. All right, free to go. My person home. Yeah, someone's going to show their true colors. They're going to reach out. But I would just say... <sighs> gems don't open up Pandora's box, baby. Do it the right way. Do it the right way. Alright. You don't wait on anybody. That's it, Jim. I did I say collective? I'm sorry if I say that. <laughs> collective. Do it the right way. Thank you. Do it the right way, collective. See, cold shoulder. This person does not deal with rejection or pain very well. They resort to punishment via giving the cold shoulder. They do not wish to deal with you right now. So I feel like this could 7766 could be significant. Okay, 5522 as well. Alright, this person could be 
I feel like this is whoever this young energy is, okay? The Knight of Cups in the reverse, stringing you along, all right? Somebody is no longer interested in pursuing the connection. Lying, okay? This person keep things to themselves. They're not being completely honest with you. All right, seeking help. So somebody wants to, is seeking help from someone or wants to seek help from you to help them through tough times in their life and then falling back. Time and space is necessary right now to reflect on thoughts and feelings they may be experiencing. They are falling back to check in with themselves. But communication may not be the easiest for this person, but they're willing to open up and try to express how they feel. Okay, but then I do see here this string alone. So... I just feel like this is whoever this energy is. Yeah, look. And then we have here projecting. We have negative thoughts. Make time. Going for it. Okay, so somebody is determined. So I feel like you have more than one person um, collective trying to come towards you. Okay, this person is trying to process what's happening or what happened between you two. Thank you. But somebody do not want to give up on this opportunity with you at all. All right, um, but don't allow this person to gaslight you. And if they have tried to in the past, I feel like you need to call them out on it, be straight up, and let them know that you know that they thank you, that you know that they were playing mind games, okay, and that all they have been trying to do is distract you for what's really going on. You know what I'm saying? Like, this could be the type of person they haven't opened up to you emotionally in any way, okay. Um, This person is somebody's fake. <sighs> yeah, look at this side piece manipulate. So just be careful. Be careful because of karma. Okay. This will be a lesson. A major lesson. All right. So we have here stonewalling, no words, mixed emotions. Somebody could be overwhelmed. It could be a little unsure of their feelings right now. So, okay. Somebody may be forced to move on from a situation. All right. Somebody, though, wants a serious commitment. So that's why I say, and then we have revenge. They believe you caused a great deal of pain and they want to hurt you in return. So somebody here, I feel like that's that King of Swords energy. That's why I say you have quite a few people collected that, you know, you have a new love that wants to come in and show you some sort of, you know, stability and, you know, giving equal give and take, happiness, that sort of thing. Let's see what we can get about this new love. What do you tell the collective about this new love? What insight? Okay, learning. You are unique and special, and I've never met anyone like you before. You have, you have, hold on, these words are small. You have opened me up to things that I never knew were possible. I am so strong because of the power of our, of our love. You have opened my heart to the truth, and I'm very grateful for all the lessons that we are both learning now. So, this person is going through some sort of lessons. I mean, y'all don't know each other. I mean, you never know, honey. This person may love something about you. I can't say whether they do or whether they don't, but our love is real. Wow. Okay. And, oh, what's this? Now, we have signs. They've been seeing so many signs of synchronicity that remind them of you. It's made them certain that you are the one for them and have a brighter future. And y'all have a brighter future. They just have to figure out how to follow them. They're gaining strength and courage for that. Okay. I want to make love to you, which we have never experienced before. I told you somebody is thinking about what it would be like to be with you, but karmic battle. So I told you this person is dealing with a karmic. Okay. 
Somebody's dealing with a karmic issue here. Please be patient with my process of growth and changes as I come into my power. I am making sure that everything is in alignment so I can be with you. I am severing my ties with a karmic situation and completing a cycle. Didn't I tell you that? But I don't feel like, it's not like this person is leaving this person to just come and be with you. This person is leaving this person because it's stunting their growth. Okay? So, don't take it. Yeah, see, they're making changes. They're changing. But this person daydreams about you a lot. They think about you a lot. And this person could possibly want to gift you some sort of flowers. Okay? But I do feel this energy of someone does not want to overstep their boundaries. They know you guys have a mission together. building blocks let's build together i told you this is someone who wants to build who's going to want to build with you one of these people red flags don't overlook the warnings regarding the situation someone may act in a very negative and destructive way is it really healthy for you okay so um i just feel like if it's that past person yeah they're gonna come with the i'm sorry's and this this that and, the, and third but um this person could only want like intimacy uh but i do yeah third party situation and then children involved so that's why i'm feeling like just you can control this you can take the lead in this uh collective you really can yeah psychic connection there's a psychic connection between you two okay y'all think exactly the same your intuition is telling you uh the right thing about this situation in this person so you know and we have time to say goodbye, okay? Rigid. And then we have acceptance and optimism, all right? And we have third-party situation. Um, there's a literal rival or piece of people gossiping. Family and friends may try to influence your relationship. So this may be something that, yeah, you may want to definitely focus on self-love okay that's why i said you can definitely keep the boundaries focus on what's going on now not what's going you know what could happen okay we have message and then we have new love a new door will soon be open for you new love for you is on the way this can be a new phase in a relationship enjoy the excitement and have faith all right karmic relationship there's something so take it slow Take it slow. There's something to be a lesson. You and someone are supposed to... We have commitment and children and then boundaries. Didn't I say that? Red flags. Didn't I say that? So, it's more so, like I said, you can control the narrative. Okay? This Somebody may want to spend quality time with you or may want to ask you out. I feel like you need to just be straight up and honest, honest and truthful and be like, look, you know, I can't make you any promises. You know, I do find you very interesting. You know, I feel like you're a really cool person. But at the end of the day, you have a whole situation going on, okay? You can feel like definitely if they are coming out of a situation, there's going to be some healing that they're going to need to do. Why? Because this is someone that they possibly been chained and bound to for some time. So they're going to have to go through some sort of healing themselves. But there's nothing wrong with, you know, having a friendship, being possibly, you know, somebody that they can talk to, relate to. Um, I do feel like this is like a situation where, you know, y'all could definitely um, help one another out in outlooks in life. You know, you could be healed to a certain place. And, you know, granted, we are all responsible for our own healing, but we have people who come into our life to also trigger that healing or to help push somebody in the right direction you know what i'm saying like everybody don't know certain stuff so 
they just may need someone who you may be experienced in certain things, you know, and can give them insight, like that type of thing. You can easily be friends. It doesn't have to always. Now, they can dream and fantasize to the cows come home. That don't mean you have to actually entertain or indulge, you know, indulge in that. So, you know, it's cute. <laughs> so, that's what I have for you, my collective. Thank you guys and gals so much for your love and support. Please hit that like button. Okay share subscribe hit that notification bell so you can be notified when they are new videos posted all right hit the all okay so you can get all notifications and for when i post um any post look you are intoxicating i told you honey somebody feels like you are the coot the gras okay i'm mad at you collection they feel like you are the coup de gras. Look at this. Crystal clear. Breaking molds. Okay. Break boundaries. Erase all identification. Anything which fixes you permanently into one mold. A new way, different, unique. Wish granted. Your time is now. Okay. Crystal clear. It's time to see your life and its limitless potential without seeing through. Hold on. With, yeah, without seeing through rose tinted glasses. Clarity. So see things for what it is. All right. Creative forces. Some of y'all going to see y'all um, creativity rise. Middle of the road. Careful not to get trapped between two extremes. Find one middle ground. Okay. Confirmation on that. And then we have good gossip. All right. Your reputation is very good at this time, okay? Or you're being talked about in a positive way. So somebody is definitely talking about you, okay? We have unlikely source. So wonderful things can happen in everything around you, even from some of the most unexpected sources. And we have survival. Time to reset your mindset and thrive and let go of your old coping mechanisms that are keeping you at the status quo. All right, so release any fears, collective. And then we have superior, okay? We have become a leader in the situation. Did not say that? Speak and act with authority. Set your boundaries and know your limits. That's it. <laughs> like, that's it. And then we have helpful change. You will, you will navigate through change successfully by allowing the universe to assist you when you need it most. And just like I said, make sure that you're not riding the fence and in the metal. We have repetition. Sometimes in order to move forward, we must repeat situations in order to learn an important lessons. So I would just say, if you don't want to be caught up in a karmic situation, you have to have that superior energy. Speak your truth and don't back down. You know how you feel. Okay, you have divine vision. Get out of your own way. Discard your projected outcomes and allow yourself to see beyond. All right? Period. You don't have to move in fear, but, you know, set your boundaries, explore options. Exactly. Explore new opportunities and look into other options that you may not have considered or noticed before. Because there's about to be a major breakthrough for you, collective. Love you guys and gals. See you in your next one. Peace.